All right, just a little bit of tricks on brakes and how to do them. That's your brake assembly. That's your makeshift brakes. If you look at it, there's your airline coming in, your airline. Brake chamber, brake chamber. Your thumb is your clamp, your push rod, slack adjuster, brake drums, and your shoes. Now I'll explain it all to you. In my airline, my airline is properly mounted and secured. It's not cracked, damaged, or leaking. It goes into my brake chamber. My brake chamber is properly mounted and secured. It's not cracked, damaged, or leaking. It is held in place with a brake chamber clamp. My brake chamber clamp is properly mounted and secured, not cracked, damaged, or loose. Goes to my push rod. My push rod is properly mounted and secured. It's not cracked, damaged, or bent and it should be about a 90 degrees to my slack adjuster. With my slack adjuster, with the wheels ch chalked and brakes released, I should not have more than one inch of free play. Next, I'm gonna go into my brake drums. My brake drums are properly mounted and secured. They're not cracked, damaged, or broken, or missing. Free of debris, not oil soaked, and no discoloration. Discoloration would indicate overheating. Going into my Brake shoes, my brake shoes are properly mounted and secured, or brake pads, properly mounted and secured, not cracked, damaged, or broken, or missing, free of debris, not oil soaked, and not less than a quarter inch of pad. You just have to say that three different times on all three axles, and that's it.